Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I was cleaning out my garage and noticed that I had three types of tire shine, so I thought might as well do a review on all three and compare them and see which one is best. The first product is Silk Shine Dressing from Chemical Guys, and this is more of a general dressing product as opposed to an exclusive tire shine product, and it can be used for tires, vinyl, uh, plastic and rubber trim, bumper guards, so a bunch of different things. The next product is Armor All Tire Foam, and this is quite literally a foam that you spray onto the tires, and it acts as both a cleaning solution and a tire shine. Lastly, we have Turtle Wax Wet and Black Tire Shine, and this is supposed to provide a deep shine without any sling coming off the tires onto the car as the tires rotate. So I have the C4 all cleaned up and washed and I degreased all of the tires so they are ready for tire dressing. And what I think I'll do is apply the dressing and then drive the car about 100 miles and then take a look and see how well each one of these products held up. And uh, I'm going to use a separate applicator for each product just to make sure there's no overlap from one to the other when I'm applying it. Okay, so tire shine has been applied. And since I only have three products, I just went ahead and applied the Turtle Wax product on both driver's side tires. And this one went on pretty well. Um, it seemed to be the thickest of the three products. And um, I've used this one in the past and it seems to work pretty well. So here's a look at the driver's side rear tire. So this is still the Turtle Wax product. And as you can see, it has a pretty good shine on it. And let's move over to the passenger side front tire, which is the Chemical Guys product. And I don't think this looks as shiny. Um, this, this product was a little watery, it seemed like, but it still looks good. And I know this side of the car is shaded, so the light or lack thereof kind of changes the way it looks, but overall it looks good. So lastly, we have the passenger side rear tire, which is the Armor All Tire Foam. And this went on really well, just used the tire applicator and this looks good. So this is gonna be close, you guys. Just a few quick comments about the tire applicators. If you don't have any of these, I highly recommend getting some and using them when you apply your tire shine. And that's just because if you try and apply the tire shine directly to the tire, it's, in my experience, impossible to not get it everywhere. You know, it gets on the wheels, it gets on the wheel wells, and you have to spend time and energy cleaning those areas again. So these things are cheap. You can get two of them for six or seven bucks on Amazon. I'll put a link in the description below. And yeah, these are a must have in my opinion. Now I'm just gonna reset the trip odometer just so I can keep track of how many miles I've driven. And again, my goal is to go 100 miles and then take a look at the tires and see how they look. Oh man, the C4 is about to hit 80,000 miles on the clock, which means I've put about 400 miles on her. She's a great car, I'm having fun. All right, so it is a few days later and I drove 98 and a half miles. I know that's just under 100 but I think it's close enough. So let's take a look at the results and see how each tire shine product held up. Here is the driver's side, which is the Turtle Wax. And when I was driving the 98 and a half miles, I did all kinds of driving. So freeway, neighborhood, stop and go traffic. And the weather was nice the whole time. I didn't drive through any puddles or rain or anything like that. So as you can see, the Turtle Wax held up really well. It's obviously not as shiny as it was when I applied it, but that's to be expected. And the sun's going down, so the light's not the best, but that side looks really good. So let's take a look at the passenger side rear, which is the Armor All Tire Foam. And this looks really good as well. And honestly, it looks about the same as it did when I applied it. So I like it. Lastly, we have the Chemical Guys dressing. And this looks good as well. It uh, looks like it still has some good shine and the way it has set in on the tire is pretty even and consistent. So I don't know, this is pretty close. 
Honestly, you guys, I don't think you could go wrong with any of these products. I think they all held up really well and they do a good job. As far as pricing goes, the Turtle Wax is about eight bucks. The Tire Foam is about five bucks and the Chemical Guys dressing is about seven bucks. So they're all comparable in price. So with all of that said, my final conclusion and opinion is that the Turtle Wax is the best initial shine and the tire foam is the best bang for your buck and the chemical guys silk shine dressing is the best overall i honestly just feel like the chemical guys product maintained the best shine and when i applied it to the tire it seemed like it went on consistently and evenly and it stayed that way after 100 miles so in my opinion this is the winner that does it for this video guys i'm going to link all of the products used in this video in the description below Hopefully you enjoyed this review and comparison. If you did, please hit the like button and please subscribe so you don't miss any car content on this channel. And let me know in the comments below which product you think held up the best. Thanks so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys next time.